Hello, hello, veggie fam. It's your girl, Ashley of Frabless Veggies, coming in with another Test Tuesday. This week, we're keeping it simple, and we're going to review plantain croutons from Sprouts. Now, I know what you're thinking, because I was thinking it too. Um, who would have thought to do plantain croutons? But you know what? I'm here for it. And if this is your first time tuning in, thank you guys so much. This is how we do. We take a vegan, plant-based product. We taste test it, we give a star rating, and we wrap up the video at the end because why spend that money, honey? Why spend that money, honey? If you don't have to, I'll do it for you. Also, if you are a veggie fan returning, thank you guys so much. Are you following me on my socials though? Are you following me on my socials? Yes, make sure right here to follow me on my socials to stay up to date with me throughout the week. And let's get into this review, shall we? And boom. So here is a closer look. I'm trying to not get the shine on it, okay? It's always a struggle with this type of packaging and not blind y'all. So <laughs> I'm gonna try my best, but here is a closer look. Uh, it's the plantain croutons. It's the garlic and herb one. Um, I didn't mention that in the beginning of the video, but it's the garlic and herb. And right there, it shows that it's vegan and it's gluten-free for all of you gluten-free people. It's gluten-free, okay? And we're gonna flip it over. Shout out to Sprouts. I'm obsessed with them. Um, let's pray that, you know, maybe I can get a partnership, okay? Let's speak that into existence, but <laughs> let's focus on the main ingredients, okay? So, top five, y'all know how I do. It's plantain, um, high oleic, oh, mm -mm. you know what? See, look at me tripping over that. We, oleic, there we go, sunflower oil. <laughs> um, seasoning powder, which is a mix of garlic powder, salt, um, and some additional spices like rosemary, thyme, all that good stuff, sugar, onion powder, and then it goes into just the anti-caking agent, um, which I find in a lot of things that they wanna have shelf life, they put that in there. So we just keeping that in mind for all of you so you know what's there, okay? And then moving on to the calories here, you get 35 calories, one tablespoon is a serving, okay? You get about 16 in the container. Now, as far as the sodium, we are doing good today, okay? Because the past few videos, it's been high, honey, but it's only 30 milligrams. Shout out to that, yes. You can get a little potassium because, you know, plantain is like a banana. You know, you get a little potassium in that. Okay, so I'm gonna try to open this up because they do a little thing here. So we'll do that. So you can kind of see inside. And that's what it's looking like. The good news is we don't have to cook today to do the product. You just eat it and enjoy it. So I'm gonna get to that part right now. Okay, so we're giving fresh face today, okay? So be be gentle. <laughs> I figure why not switch it up sometimes? Cause sometimes I don't wear makeup all the time. So you're getting fresh face today. I know that is not why y'all are here, but I wanted to say that because I'm gonna be oop in your face. <laughs> but anyway, I just figured let's just pour a little in a bottle. Okay. These are really little teeny, teeny weeny little bites, okay? Now let's taste test it because I like a little crunch in my salads. I don't always want to do tortilla chips, so this might be the move. So let's see, hold on. I'm gonna get close so you can hear the crunch. Hmm. Okay, that crunch is a little bit better. Mm-hmm. Mm. I don't know how I feel yet. <laughs> but let's get to it, because y'all don't need to be here forever. Okay, so things that I, let me wipe, wipe my hands. Things that I love, okay? Um, I love that it has a little bit of kick to it. I'm definitely tasting the rosemary. I like the seasoning. I give you that. Um, and you know I love plantain, so I'm a little biased. I do love the flavor of the sweetness of the plantain with the seasoning, so I love that. Mm, I will say for the love me nots, we gonna slide into that because I mean it's it's pretty hard to like do a crouton, so let's get to the love me nots. <laughs> um, I don't like how tiny they are. 
Um, and maybe just because I'm used to plantain chips, I don't know. But with them being so small, I can see you kind of, you know, you gotta make sure you really chomp chomp crunch it up, you know? Um, and some of the bits are crispier than the others, you know? Like that was crispy, but I had a couple of them that were a little like soft and soggy, which are not bad. You see how hard that was to kind of pull straws or whatever? Overall, I could see this being a good like salad topper. I could. Um, for the star rating, I'm not really, now this is the thing. I love their regular plantain chips. I'm gonna put a picture here of their regular plantain chips. Or hold on, actually I'll let you see it, hold on. Okay, so here are their regular plantain chips. Let me see if I can open it up. So you know I'm a fan for real. I'm really a fan. So look how, you know, obviously their chips, they're bigger. Did you hear a crunch? You see what I'm saying? <laughs> I got you, hold on. <laughs> okay, so with that being said, with the difference, you see what I'm working with? I love a crunch. My personal is going to be a three stars only because I want more of the crispy that I get in their plantain chips, but in the crouton and maybe make it a little bit bigger. The bite's a little bit bigger, but I don't know. It could just be me. Um, they're just really small and I don't know. They're a lot smaller and I like the larger crouton. So that's a personal preference, but I don't know. But you know what? We're going to wrap up the video. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Okay, you guys, what do we think? Comment below if you've tried this product, if you plan to try the product, what would you give a star rating? Comment below. And thank you guys so much for tuning in with your girl Ashley of Fred Bliss Veggies, where we're always cooking up fresh greens on a daily. Again, here are all of my socials to stay up to date with me throughout the week. And thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.